doll the twits. The twits are turned upside down. What's this? gasped Mr. Twit as they entered the living room. What happened? screamed Mrs. Twit. They stood in the middle of the room looking up. All the furniture, the big table, the chairs, the sofa, the lamps, the little side tables, the cabinet with a bottle of beer in it, the ornaments, the selected trick fire, the carpet, everything was stuck upside down to the ceiling. The pictures were upside down on the walls. And the floor they were standing on was absolutely bare. What's more, it had been painted white to look like the ceiling. Look, screamed Mrs. Twit. That's the floor. The floor's up there. It's the ceiling. We are standing on the ceiling. We're upside down, gasped Mr. Twit. We must be upside down. We are standing on the ceiling, looking down at the floor. Oh, help, screamed Mrs. Twit. Help, 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 help. I'm beginning to feel... Gridly. So am I, so am I, cried Mr. Twit. I don't like this one little bit. We're upside down, and all the blood's going to my head, screeched Mrs. Twit. If we don't to do something quickly, I shall die. I know I will. I've got it, cried Mr. Twit. I know what we've got to do. We'll stand on our heads, then anyways, we'll be right away up. And so they stood on their heads, and of course, the moment the top of their head touched the floor the sticky glue that the ravens had brushed on a few moments ago did before did it chop they were stuck the they were pinned down cement glued fixed to their floorboards through a crack in the door the monkey squash they jumped right out of their cage the moment the twits had gone inside the and the roly poly watched and all the other birds flew in out and out to catch a glimpse of this extraordinary sight.